11-year-old Sangita Thapa and 10-year-old Parvati Thapa arrived in Kathmandu with Soma Tamang, a family friend who had promised to show them the capital and secure a workplace for the girls. However, a foul play was in action and what the parents thought was a good idea for their daughters turned out to be a human trafficking racket. The traffickers had arranged for the two young girls to be taken to India. The girls were spared the horror when Nepal police got a hint of their deeds and the traffickers were arrested. Police claimed that the traffickers Fujun Thapa, Rukum, Moimindu Tamang from Nuakot, Sonam Lama and Soma Tamang are major players in the human trafficking business in Nepal. It is believed that they are well known in the Indian market as well. Along with 140,000 rupees, the police retrieved cell phones, bus tickets and hotel bookings from the culprits. They were planning to sell the girls at a price of 160,000 rupees. There is proof that this group has already sold off 10 girls into the market, including a sister of one of the group members. The Nepalese law entitles those accused in human trafficking to 15 years of imprisonment along with 500,000 rupees in fine. Every year, thousands of Nepalese girls are sold into prostitution. Many young children are also forced into this business. It is often illiterate, uneducated girls from the rural area that fall prey to this business. Many have been saved by police and organizations have come forward to help survivors lead a normal life. But Nepal still has a long way to go until this trade is completely eradicated. There are many social and economic factors that perpetuate such unpleasant circumstances, poverty being the utmost.